Infinite stamina still works after update 2.2, which one of the fixes was in regards to obtaining infinite stamina. But that's not correct because that glitch is still there. And this is not a new method at all, this is something old that's been in the game for years now. But this is how you do it. So what you want to do is grab a farming tool. Uh, it works better if you have a pick or a pickaxe. And now you want to have that item too. Whenever you press the default unwield button, which should be X, um, you want to you equip and unequip that item. So now what you do is uh, put that item away, uh, do an emote, or it works better for me if I raise my hands, and now press backspace and X, and keep going back and forth. So now if you do it correctly, then you're gonna have infinite stamina like I do right now. And now you can go ahead and run around can roll and you'll use up some stamina you know like in normal mode but if you jump your stamina will automatically go back to 100% also you can farm uh, you know like rocks brimstone just anything that you want now if you want to cancel the glitch you just simply pull out a weapon and your stamina will go back to normal Another thing to keep in mind is that horses will not gain infinite stamina. Uh, you can see here I'm going to sprint and the stamina meter is uh, going to be normal for the horse because it's separate from your character. But now when you get off the horse your character is still going to have infinite stamina. So using a horse does not cancel that glitch. Same goes for taking damage on a horse. Uh, say you got lanced and you're dismounted, right? So I'm gonna do this example here by jumping off this cliff and yeah, I'm dismounted right now. See, I took a bunch of damage and I'll just wait till my stamina comes back and you can see here that I still have infinite stamina. But now if I get on my horse and I start using the spear. You know, I just swing away and then get off the horse. And now I no longer have the glitch. Final thoughts about this. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure they're never going to fix this problem now because it's been it's been long enough. But yeah, it's still this is this should tell you something that Whenever you read the patch notes, uh, the Funcom releases, you should try and test things out because most of the time, you know, whatever is written down and then posted uh, as their patch notes or update is not going to be correct. There's still going to be problems that are going to still be there, even though they said they fixed them. And also, there's going to be other things that are uh, broken due to the update. 